When you subscribe we will use the information you provide to send you these newsletters. Sometimes they'll include recommendations for other related newsletters or services we offer. Our privacy notice explains more about how we use your data, and your rights. You can unsubscribe at any time. Bank Holiday Monday was far from the warm, sunny conditions many Britons had hoped for as indoor hospital venues remain closed due to Covid restrictions. Instead, much of the UK was battered by strong winds of up to 75 miles per hour and heavy downpours, with the storm set to continue into Tuesday morning. Roads were closed and train lines blocked due to down trees and flooding. Car accidents were also recorded, with the Met Office's yellow weather warning for winds still in place today. Wales saw the worst of the gale, force winds, with 75 miles per hour gusts recorded in parts of the country. BBC Wales meteorologist Eric Brockway said the wind and rain caused temperatures to plummet to one of the coldest early May bank holidays on record. He wrote on Twitter at 3.30 p.m. Yesterday, the wind has reached storm force 10 on Mumbles Head in Swansea with a gust of 74 miles per hour this afternoon. As well as being wet, it's also one of the coldest early May bank holidays on record. Temperatures in most places in single figures. The stormy conditions left homes without power for hours on end, as the wind and heavy rain battered the region. Both Western Power Distribution and Scottish Power Energy Networks suffered power outages. The worst affected regions were in Conwy, Gwynedd, and Anglesey. Dozens of major roads were also forced to close, due to flooding and uprooted trees. Flooding has been reported on the A470 northbound near the Taff's Well Interchange, while the A4489 in Sun will be closed for some time due to a large tree blocking the road. Train services have also been disrupted because of flooding. Berkshire was also badly affected by the storm, with local police describing driving conditions as poor. A Thames Valley police spokesman said, Poor driving conditions out there tonight some trees down in West Berkshire like this one in Mans Hill. Burfield. The road there has now been cleared. Traffic's cops reported a number of incidents on major roads such as the A34 northbound, the M4 westbound and the M3 last night. Power cuts were also recorded in areas of the county, including West Berkshire. This morning, power outages were reported in Padworth. A yellow Met Office wind warning remains in force until 9 a.m which covers huge swathes of southern England and Wales. The heavy downpours seen in Monday are also expected to continue through the morning. A Met Office forecaster said, as we head into Tuesday we will see the heavy, persistent rain clearing to the east but showers are following behind and it is going to remain windy. BBC forecasters added, today, scattered showers will persist through the day, wintry over the Scottish hills. Showers will be most frequent in central areas with sunny spells developing further north and south. Breezy.